Hi. So I'm Peggy Eninga, your light health and lifestyle coach. And today I just wanted to share a couple ideas for um, food prep for you when you bring your groceries home. Um, it makes your shopping day maybe uh, have a little bit longer in the sense that you've got a little bit more to do. But oh my goodness, it really makes a difference um, for any of your cooking days. You can you can have um, a meal done literally in minutes or just you just save a lot of time. Anyway, I'm going to share a couple things with you. Um, I like to chop up my um, bell peppers. So I chop them when I bring them home and put them in the freezer. And it's all of this really actually saves on waste as well. Besides saving time when you're cooking, it saves on waste because if it's in the freezer, it's not going to go bad or, you know, like fresh fruits uh, do sometimes. And I like to buy the fresh um, vegetables whenever possible and um, chop them up myself instead of buying them already frozen. Some things I do buy frozen, um, but definitely buy frozen if that, if that works way better for you. Another thing I do is onions. I love to buy um, different onions, the sweet uh, Vidalia onions, sometimes the white onions, depending on what I'm doing with them. So I have a variety of onions in the freezer. Another thing that I learned from a friend is I chop up um, lemon and lime in little bits, or not bits, but small chunks. And I like to put them in Perrier water, regular water. Um, they're just they're just fun to use and um, just really helps me enjoy kind of a special little drink. Uh, sometimes another thing that I do um, for eating on the go. So that kind of helps with meal prep. A lot of those sorts of things. Um, all of my foods, carrots, celery, everything gets cleaned and chopped. So it's ready to use when I bring it home. Another thing that I really love to do is um, I uh, slice up apples and I always have a baggie of apple slices in the fridge um, for us. Um, I will just grab them and take them on the go um, when I'm going to be gone for the day. Another thing that I really like to do is I have a little lunch bag and I just put a small um, like freezer um, pack, ice pack thingy in there. And I will take uh, Greek yogurt and then I make kind of my own, I'll show you my own little kind of seed granola mixture. And I just have some of this and sprinkle on. Um, I like to buy the plain Greek yogurt. So I will use, and I just don't have a good taste for that by itself. So I will take a little bit of um, the 100% uh, uh, maple syrup, organic syrup, and I will just drizzle a little bit on to give it a little bit of sweetness um, and put that on. You could eat it plain or put some fruit on. If you've got fruit, that really is good too. But anyway, my little seed thing is um, sesame seeds, sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, um, a little bit of ground flax, um, a little, small amount of um, hemp seed um, and chia seeds. So that is really a good combination. I have that with me when I'm going um going to be gone for most of the day and i can eat that anytime doesn't matter if it's later morning or lunchtime whenever whenever i get a break and it's extremely satisfying um it's it sticks with you and your body feels satisfied because there's a lot of protein in that and my body my body likes protein so Anyway, hopefully that is just just some tiny little tips to help you with your meal prep and eating healthy on the go. Have a great day.